Good morning and welcome to another full day of eating and it is my birthday weekend if you watched my evening of eating on Thursday <laughs> that was like a, an evening to celebrate my birthday, it's now the weekend so we're now uh, going away we've come away to uh, North London to my uh, grandparents house, my nonna and nonna they're the Italian side of my family um, and we are doing something which I don't know what, like Sarah has planned a surprise weekend so I'm super super excited but I have no idea what we're doing so I can't really fill you in on my plan now I'm currently in the process of drinking a coffee and I've also got my uh, vitamin I've got a kind of open supplement type things down here so I've got my glucosamine <clears throat> Uh, cod liver oil and then my alpha male which is just like a multivitamin so I'm gonna have this stuff uh, then I'm gonna head down and grab breakfast um, probably the best thing about being here is that they have Weetos which is like the greatest cereal in the world so I'm gonna head downstairs I'm gonna grab myself some Weetos then I'm gonna really quickly go to the gym I've got a train because it's a Saturday so I'm gonna go and do um, doing squats and bench press so I'll try and do it really really quick <clears throat> I'm gonna go to Lee Valley which is like it's pretty cool actually it's like a like an athletic center, so it's like an indoor track and stuff. It's actually where I used to train sometimes or compete sometimes when I was doing athletics, so it's quite cool. It'd be like a little trip down memory lane. So I'll go there, do my squats and bench press as quick as I can, come back, have a shower, and then I'll let the exciting birthday events unravel. So I will probably catch up with you next when I'm uh, done from the gym. Whoa, sir. Hey, my weeders go over you like that. That was pretty good. I'll give it like a seven out of 10, I guess, considering the circumstances. The place is friggin' awesome, boy. Like I said earlier, I did used to train here and compete here and stuff, and the facilities are quality. Like the, it's all obviously like Olympic weightlifting type stuff, but the setup is so nice. There's like six or seven platforms, loads of racks, loads of weights. It's pretty awesome. Um, anyway, yeah, I did. I got up to a like a 220 squat, which is not great, but. Um, Obviously, it's really early in the morning. I squatted last night. I've kind of got up quick and just got out so I can get it done. Obviously, to give uh, Sears's like birthday plans more time to come to fruition because I feel bad. Um, and then bench press again. It was like 160, so a pretty conservative single. But the it was one of the kind of the rolling bars. So obviously, it's designed for Olympic weightlifting to let the plates slide around. And what that meant is I felt really unstable on the bench. The bar was like moving in my uh, the weights were kind of rolling when I was holding the bar, so I felt like it was moving in my hands. Uh, like some kind of oh, um, like proprioceptive uh, shoulder rehab exercise, but yeah, I've got it done. I'm now gonna um, have some protein because I forgot to have it this morning, so I brought a stash of it with me for the weekend. So I'm gonna have like a double shot, so I guess like 50 or so grams. And I've also, because I forgot to bring any kind of post training snack, have a look at this. This is one of the presents went for dinner last night, and this is one of the presents that I got. Uh, it's from my uncle, I think, actually. Not, I think it was from my uncle. Look at those bad boys. Uh, pretty feminine, but I'm not going to complain because they look bloody incredible. So I'll probably eat one of those now, have my protein, uh, go home. I say go home, go back to my nonna's, uh, have a shower, and then I'll update you on the plan as and when things develop. Okay, I'm back, I've showered, and I'm wearing clean clothes. We're pretty much ready to go. I've got a bit of an idea of the plan. We're basically going to go and do something. <clears throat> They're making uh, sandwiches downstairs to bring with us now. So obviously lunch is going to be kind of eating on the go. Um, and then we're staying somewhere else tonight. So obviously going somewhere else. So it's exciting. Now I'm going to show you this because while I'm here, I didn't show you this earlier. I got this from my brother and his girlfriend uh, this morning. So it's a first series, but then the cool part. So I'm obviously 30. There are 30 choc 
chocolate variations in this box. Pretty much the coolest present of all time. Right, that's weird, never even seen that before. So crunchy there. That's really weird, but I'm intrigued to try it. Uh, very milk. There's basically 30 friggin' cool chocolate bars. What a present. Um, like I said, that is for my brother and his girlfriend who are actually currently downstairs with Sarah's making sandwiches, I believe. So, uh, let's wander down and see how the sandwich prep is coming on. Going down the stairs in my grandma's house. Here we are. Sandwiches being that's garlic bread. Bread sandwiches. Sandwiches are in here. And then, Nonna, say hello. Hello. <laughs> right, let's go. Right, we are kind of halfway on our journey. We've stopped to eat uh, lunch, which I'm going to show you now. Says made me a sandwich, Nonna's, I believe. Ooh. So it's like chicken escalope and then lettuce and tomato and mayonnaise, which looks pretty friggin' good. Then there's like another one in there, so she's doubled up. And then there is also, uh, this is like pie, so it's like uh, summer fruits pie, like uh, apple and like berries and stuff. It's pretty good, it's really warm, that's nice. A banana, I've got some coke in the car, and then I've also got uh, the 50 million chocolate bars that my brother got me, which is pretty handy, so I'll be eating some of those on the journey. Oh my god, so I'm gonna have this. And then we're gonna get going, and let's find out where we end up. And we're here. So we have come to uh, Norwich, it's pretty cool because my brother is at uni in Norwich, so we're gonna kind of hang out with him in a minute. We're in like a B&B &B right now, which is pretty, Cool, show you around. Um, banana and oranges, a bit phallic, uh, some tea stuff. This is the bed. Which I'm gonna jump on! That's me wearing my socks. Oh, got a hole in, awkward. And this is the bathroom uh, where the magic happens. Yeah, so. Um, ate like an hour ago, I guess. I'm pretty flat. Like, the sandwiches were pretty uh, substantial. Then I had like a banana and the coke, and I had a bit of pie, uh, so I'm good for a bit. So I guess I'll probably grab you when there is some more food-based activity occurring. And we are out. Uh, we're in like the shopping centre, Chipperfield, Copperfield, something with the C and then Field. Also has the biggest Apple store in the world. The friggin' size of that. Is it need to be that big? I don't think so. Anyway, um. We have obviously eaten, but we're going to get some kind of like drink, maybe like a milkshake or something, just to keep the calories going in because it's fun to eat slash drink stuff. So I will see you when we found something suitable. We've come to Costa and I've got myself a creamy cooler, which sounds pretty good. Um, Belgian chocolate flavour. Haven't actually got it yet, I'm going to get it in like 10 seconds, so I will see what it's like. <laughs> And we are back. Whoa, it's like half five, so like early evening. Um, pretty full up because that weird chocolate cream thing was pretty sickly. It was nice though, and uh, also very, very cold, so it was like killing my mouth as I was trying to drink it. I was getting serious brain freeze. Um, I'm just gonna hang out for a bit. I'm gonna eat this apple, I think. Mmm, that isn't very nice. Uh, we're gonna hang out for a bit. We booked a table at. Uh, Bills, I think it's called, which is like a various food place. I think it has like burgers and stuff, so I'll probably get a burger to be honest. Um, so if nothing else interesting happens, I'll see you when we are in there. We're going to Bills, it is just a person's name. Technically, it's a lazy name for a restaurant. That is very loud and unsociable. Right, the menu looks pretty decent. Um, initially it did look quite fish based, but upon further investigation, I think it should be alright, so here we go. <laughs> <laughs> 
We'll, we'll see there, man, yeah? I'm thinking this, with this, and that. Okay, so this is, uh, like I suggested a minute ago, the burger, Bill's Burger, his own burger, with uh, bacon and cheese, and then loads of other crap in there as well. It's pretty massive, so it's going to be hard to eat. I'm going to have to squash it down quite significantly. And then I have some fries as well. And Sarah's got like some lamb coffers, which let's face it, you probably won't eat, so I'll probably end up eating like some as well. Um, and then I have some cider. <laughs> and we are back home jesus christ what a night so um you would have seen there i ate uh, like three quarters of a kebab which i didn't plan on getting but it was brought for me so i'm not going to turn down extra calories um it's like half past two now which is the latest i've gone to bed in freaking ages i had a few drinks like nothing excessive so i'm feeling okay but um, what I'm going to do now, in the name of uh, safety, is consume one of these. Now this is like a uh, a weird uh, says what is it like a Japanese? Yeah, it is like a Japanese anti hangover cure, uh, which I think is basically like a super electrolyte based drink. It's really salty. It smells literally disgusting. <laughs> Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, Jesus Christ. It tastes like, imagine you get a massive mouthful of like seawater, and then you get loads of like salt and vanilla crisps and like scrunch them up and then mix it all together, and then vomit in it and then mix that together and then drink it. That's exactly how it tastes. I'm going to have that. Oh, if I can keep it down, I'll drink that. And I'm also going to have, I've got my protein here, so I'll have like 30 grams of whey mixed with water. I'm pretty full up because I've eaten quite a lot this evening, but um, I'll do that just for the protein and the banter. Um, and then that pretty much concludes my day, guys. It's been really, really fun. It's been an awesome birthday weekend. I really hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. It means a lot to me. And as I always say, it helps the channel out. And I will see you tomorrow.